All right, settle down. We still have now the final part to show you where either Doris was wrong and I was right because of her size and we're going to find out. Let's just see how she looks. Because guys, I tell you, if you feel like you're plus size, Doris, come through. If you feel like you're plus size, don't dress in plus size clothes. Okay? Ta-da! Okay? I told you, she's at 20. This 22 story and dressing at 26 was just wrong. Where's the mic? How do you talk to Doris? Uh -huh. What's going on? I'm very happy. You're very happy? Yeah. When people are happy with their outlook, <laughs> makes me very happy. Hence, look good, feel good. Mm. When you're getting dressed, do you think like this jeans is going to work? No. <laughs> you're thinking, no, Crystal, this jeans <laughs> now. Eh? <laughs> what kind of jeans do you have? Street. But do they look like this? Yes. But do they compliment you like this? Not, not exactly like not, this. Not like this. But and guys, remember what I was saying about here? See? It's not, it's not skinny. She's not trying to compete with her hips. You get? Mm -hmm. And then Doris is not comfortable with showing too much of her hips. How about we do this as opposed to doing the really big clothes? Mm -hmm. Are we going to change now, Doris? Yes. You trust me now? Yes. Tell me what you said. Just say, t say what you said back there. If only you can give me this <laughs> long words. She's, she's satisfied and now she wants to walk out like this. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Guys, do you have any questions about her body size or what she has on or how it works? You guys trust me. I am happy. <laughs> Doris, let's talk shoes. Because why I picked Doris is because a lot of ladies, um, Doris' size, really struggle with what to wear. So they end up settling for as long as I am covered and then um, I don't have to worry, uncomfortable like she's saying, yeah? I don't have to, it's not about style for you. It's about? I'm just going to yes. something. <laughs> it's, it's very honest, man. as long as she can go through her clothes, she's fine, yeah? Look, it doesn't matter, eh, for you. And see now, Doris, for you, I would put a skirt like this as well. See, glasses the hips, mm -hmm. But then your um, knees are free, uh -huh. not pencil. Okay. Yet you have really wide hips. You get it. Yeah. So if you want to remove attention from your hips, but still complement your hips, dress your like glaze your hips, mm -hmm. but loose at the knees. Okay. Mm -hmm. Cool. Now, let's talk shoes. I like what you have on. I like what you have on. But now, when it comes to heels. This would work. Could yeah. you wear this? Yeah, I can. Could wear this, yeah? So this would work because then it balances out with your hips as well. Yeah. You're not too tired. Yeah. You can be able to handle the, the weight. Guys, there's something about heels and you see why you see people walking in town like this. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure you've seen. Let's be honest. Like I, I don't like between four and six PM. They are so tired, eh? Just... It's because they're wearing the wrong shoe for their weight. You get. So Okay, mine is pretty comfortable, but say, if someone is really trying to, <laughs> to kill the look by wearing this, and she might not be size 20, but she could be like size 14 or 16. Mm -hmm. This on, on a hip size 16 is heavy. Mm -hmm. That's why you see someone walking like they're walking backwards, or they're going to fall forward, you get? Mm -hmm. So it's really heavy. So wear shoes that are going to balance out your hips. What I have on would be comfortable if you have, if you are size 16, 14, let me let you sit, you can sit. Size 16, 14, see? Trust me, you'll be very fine. So don't, don't just be stuck on flats. Let's not do flats all the time because either I am very curvy, I can't have and handle the weight, or it's just, I am sure. Let's do, okay, something a little higher. And if you are, I think even Doris, you can try this. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. Hmm? If she wants to try it now, she's like, now. <laughs> You'll be very fine, Doris. The point is, chunky heels balance out your hips and your weight, okay? But pointy heels is if you have smaller weight, like say 10, 12 if you're pushing it. But 12, you can still do a 4 p.m. of you crawling down the streets. This even uh, 16, 18, you can wear. Because guys, I just don't believe in settling in for what works. 
I believe in pushing yourself out of your comfort zone and getting into that nice look and starting to, you know, having the straight, straight look of, of walking in heels as opposed to, there's that thing where you're supposed to walk in a straight line like that, like you're a model but you're not really trying to model. That way your body is balancing so you don't, you're not walking like this. That's where it comes from. But if you walk like this, then it's very pretty easy. Okay? Cool. Any questions? For the plus cheeks. Yes. Like like uh, uh, Doris. Yeah, like Doris. Yes. Do they have to get their clothes from the tailors, like tailor made, or they can give them easily from I got her like from the shop. Huh? The jeans she's wearing is from Morris and Clad. The top she's wearing is from Kito. Done. Nothing from you don't it's not as I'm telling you just be fast look at yourself in the mirror This is who I am you want to lose weight. Yes, but this is the body I have right now So let's dress for this body that we have right now. Okay, go to the store and then go to stores that are also Maybe people who are honest you get not just somebody who wants you to buy for the sake of buying So then they'll, they'll want you to get some that will keep on hiding the your Hips like Dory says hips are very nice. I don't know why she's hiding them but somebody will compliment you and also tell you the truth. Okay? So she is the lady who I was saying that she is very hippie here. And then she has a very big, nice bust. Okay? It's nice. But now, when I look at her, I am I'm just like, hey. You know, but chicks like that, I'm sure. Chicks like that. However, it would be nice as well if she then also relaxed here. You get if you relaxed your waist area, then your hips and your bust are our attention, but it's also not making you look like they're, they're the same size. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes. So then also now just, even if you're wearing something that is high waist, it's fine. But then the top needs, even if it's tucking in, fine. But it just needs to be a little, little sweet. Cool. Question? She was just feeling shy. She told me, I don't know if I'll come. <laughs> She's feeling shy. I think then I should be able to be done with being able to give you advice unless you have something to ask me. But guys, if you nominate your Doris, get someone to nominate you, okay? Somebody from Doris's house, nominate Doris for Sally the Crystal. <laughs> she will come for the show. We'll be able to handle how she moved from dress dressing like a size 20 to a size 26. And then she can be able to have free clothes. Even you at home, you can have free clothes. Even you guys who are here and you want to be nominated for the show, you can be nominated, okay? You are like, you get free clothes, you get money to go shopping, you will get makeup starter kit like you had from Suzy Beauty the other day, and then also you have a voucher, okay, you have dinner voucher. So what you need to do is send inbox um, a story, tell us a story about the person that you're nominating. Is the person very, have they gone through a breakup, have they, are they looking for a job? Have they um, maybe had a baby and it's not, they're not getting back to themselves? Are they, um, what's the other thing? The point is just have a story. What's your story? Don't tell me, I need to be styled. What's the story? Like, what's, how is this going to impact you positively? You get, because then you want to leave a room for the other women above 25 years old who want to be impacted positively by their whole outlook. The point is to look good and to feel good. This has been Styled with Crystal. Changing names from Style My Wife, from the Look Good, Feel Good workshop, where we've been able to come together and discuss weight loss. We've been able to discuss styling your body shape. We've also been able to discuss makeup. And you've heard from all the dis different experts on what works for you. So pick what works for you. If there's any more question, question that you need to ask in the three-part series, do send messages via social media, on Facebook, at Katie and Crystal, Style with Crystal, on Twitter, at Katie and Style with Crystal. Hashtag is Crystal. That way we're able to get back to you and we'll leave a direct you straight to the guys who are handling that particular topic. Thank you for staying with us and watching our three part series. And also thank you for the audience who came to Westwood Hotel where we are holding the Look Good Feel Good workshop. Thank you so much for spending the day with me. It's been a long day. Pauline has opened her eyes and she's staring at me, thinking I had plans, Crystal, to spend the day with you. But I hope that you guys have gotten something, have you? At least from, from even if it's, you didn't come for style, maybe you came for the makeup, maybe you came for the weight loss. Whatever, whatever you came from, I hope that you've been answered, okay? And even you at home, 
by watching the show or if you need more information then you can be able to reach this guy's wellness project and also Suzy Beauty and also start with Crystal we're able to answer some particular questions that you guys have keep nominating your women in your life all above 25 years old and able to win you know there's clothing voucher and then there's clothes itself and then there's makeup and then there's hair and then there's dinner voucher oh my god that's so much even i wish i could, nomin- I could, I could be nominated <laughs> it's been a very very long day at the westwood hotel which is very very beautiful you can also come here and enjoy yourself and thank you very much for my partners for install for the bags and shoes they'll have stores everywhere in westlands in hallingham in the major malls in nairobi and also i'm very very grateful to morris and clad who have their stall at jamia mall and also true collections who have their shop at yala towers all based in town Thank you very much and also for you guys and someone who wants to go with clothes here remember to nominate and i'll be able to give you clothes to go home with <laughs> stay tuned next week as we come back with style with crystal to everyone out there make sure you watch style with crystal there's so much to learn it's such a great show i'll advise people to watch style with crystal because especially the plus size ladies those who think they can never be that smart unique in their own way but with the crystal everything will be superb you need to watch Style with Crystal so that you can learn more about how to dress your body size, how to put on your, your makeup and how to style yourself.